doubles his life. All right, so Pika Kirby, Pika Luigi, and this three stock, I think the main thing that a lot of people have in mind, like are thinking of when they hear that it's three stock doubles, is Luigi's gonna be scary, right? Oh yeah, like, Luigi can nobody. take, Luigi has taken double, there's one. Yeah, nobody, Luigi has taken double kills just off like a simple up tilt. Right, nobody takes stocks like uh, Luigi does. And now I remember uh, one of the first times we did four stock doubles, I think it was Let's Go Baltimore. And it was very interesting to note like how very minor incidental things could take away a quarter of your stocks. Like, right. like uh, Pika get up attack knocking you off stage while a Kirby is recovering, you know? Like, yep. Just very incidental stuff can massively shift the game, whereas in five stock it makes a bit less of a difference, you know? Yeah. And in three stock that becomes magnified. And then there's, you know, like you can just have, get up aired and Luigi happens to be there. And, you know, there's, there's very few stocks. She just went for it. Yeah. Oh, I would have liked to see a down beat from she but I don't know. He knows Luigi better. Ooh. He could have killed that Pico right there. He knows that one. He blew the kill initially, but or he messed up. Interesting. That was oh, a good. great option there yeah, by, uh, by the child. And that's why these, these guys, they, they know each other. They have things planned out that we wouldn't see coming. Right. It's like, oh, why didn't he just you know, go for this? But that was a much more sure option. Oh, but he gets two. And he gets another. There's three up Bs in a period of about five seconds. Down Bs. Down. I think we're going to see a lot of missed thunders in this tournament. Yeah. Oh, oh. And this is the... That was kind of a net positive for Red Team. Uh, it, it got Sheeman killed, but it got Kirby edge guarded as well. Luigi's so slow, he can't cover that too well. Well, I think, yeah, I think if one of them is going to go out there... Ooh, nice! I, I think covering the platforms is better than covering the ledge. Right. Well, Shimon had a very good down beat, down beat break there. It's kind of an interesting dynamic, though, because, like, um, I think the mo one of the most common... That was gorgeous. Yeah, that was really nice teamwork. That was a great team combo. One of the most common Pika Luigi teams that we see these days is Shears and I. And Shears is very aggressive on the edge guarding, where I think Shimon, you know, they kind of they play it more by ear. Like Shears is always gonna run off the air. Like he's always going out there right. to get the edge guard, even when like I feel like I you know, I should be you know, like I want him to stay there. <laughs> but like Shimon and Let's Go, they kinda trade that off, you know, like there are times when I think Shimon plays more on the stage than, than off the stage. You know, he's not going for as many of those nares. Oh, oh, we got the end of that combo. Oh, with, Bobby. Yeah, they have some they have some impressive teamwork. But you know, they've been teaming together for a long time now. We, yeah. we were talking about G4, and now I I want to say they've probably they probably were teaming well before that too. But I'm you know I'm not so sure. But that was years ago. I don't know how long they've been playing either. They yeah. just kind of like appeared. <laughs> well, I mean, like, let's go. He's probably been around longer than I have. I, I mean, I remember playing him at uh, G3, and wow. it's like, you know, I don't know who this guy is. He's like, oh, all right, he's, 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 he's good. Um, Sheeman, I don't Sheeman, know how long he's been. I think he's been around for a while, too. I just assume a lot of these guys have been around longer than I have. At this, run, at this point, I've been around for what feels like forever, I guess. Yeah, and me, I mean, you better. I don't forever. know even. There just comes a certain point where I don't remember when people start. Interesting. So we are getting a double peek, though. Huh. I don't know why. Maybe, uh, I want to say Sheeman might want to, uh, I don't know. He might be wanting to kind of work on it. Maybe? Uh, you never know. Well, probably a stage counter pick. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, because the ceiling is much higher on the stage. Uh, so it definitely doesn't help Luigi. Right. That's why one. one of the thought processes we had in ZPK, picking this, you know, going back to the stage against Sheeman and Let's Go, is like, it don't, like the ceiling is very high. Uh, but we'll get a peek at Sheeman and Pika. Uh, pretty good to start off. Uh, all right. Oh, should have back, back air. There were a lot of ways he could have finished that combo. He could have gone for a weak nair to a back air, but he went for the extra up air. 
really? Oh, uh, he's trying to... Oh, that was a very good yeah, there. Yeah, that was good, good positioning there to make sure he could protect himself. Uh, back throw. A little, he could have held on to him a little longer, I think, and then uh, Shimin would have been able to prepare for a uh, combo. A down smash. I like that option. Oh, all right. And great weight there by Real Leo. Yeah, so Shimin, uh, not having a good time off stage at this point. He, no. he threw away the one stock, and there he positioned himself to really get uh, kind of cranked by the down air. Oh, good save. what a save. Uh, and then, but that's the thing with Pika, is like, you, you're not going to get that as early either. Like, the right. up smash that now is. The Leo. Cleaning up one stock there, he misses the other. But... Feels like all these characters are a little bit weaker. You think of a lot of the best characters in doubles, you think of, uh, you know, Pika's, Kirby's, and Mario's. And, like, Kirby can still get the gimps, Pika can still get off stage stuff. Oh, but he didn't pull back. But, like, Kirby's forward throw is, like, a good kill move. And it is. That, gets, that gets nerfed here. Uh, Pika's up smash with Thunder, Mario's up smash combos, uh, um, Luigi's up B combos. Right. So many things get nerfed by having a higher ceiling. Leo making a few errors here in terms of good input. Teams combo, they need to get the stock. Yeah, get that down air. Uh, clean up that stock. Sure is it? Oh, but I had a this, this is a, a troublesome position now for. Um, yeah, for uh, them angry. Yeah. That was a really unnecessary last down air from uh, from Yo Leo. Yeah, he did not need that by any means. And now he's put his teammate in a 1v1 versus uh, a better player. Let's go. Like, and, you know, yeah, more experience. Pika doubles man. Um, but he is holding his own. Oh, yeah. good pivot. Reverse back air. I thought yeah. the reverse back air was coming. He's, he's doing it. He's handling this very well. I don't know. Maybe, maybe the GI was too much. Great oh, read on that back air. And, uh, yeah, let's go they, kind of... I'm angry when Yolio had an opportunity there for yeah. Yolio.